man evicted out of his home in Greeley refuses to leave. He's no longer inside, but he has made his home right in front. The neighbors are so fed up, they contacted Denver 7's Bayon Wang. He got evicted out of his house and now there's a pile of rubble next to our house. John Miller is actually referring to kind of a makeshift studio next door. The man living inside used to live in the house he's parked in front of for years. He's living on a flatbed trailer that he's constructed out of trash. Residents in this Greeley neighborhood say they are tired of the suspicious activities and want the man to gather his belongings and go elsewhere. It's right outside of our bedroom window. I work, I get up early in the morning and it's, there's constant banging and clanging and drilling and, and, and just rustling all night long. Some families keeping their children inside. Usually these streets are full of children and now the children are not coming out to play because they are scared. Several neighbors say they haven't approached him in fear of a confrontation, so we decided to speak to him ourselves. My name is Bayan Wang. I'm with Denver 7 News. Uh, we just wanted to get your side of things. Some of your neighbors have been concerned about some of the noise and, and things you've been doing in this neighborhood. The divorce has been, it's been rough for like last year. Jesse Bashirs says recent family matters have led to his downfall. No money and no more home. I ain't got nothing I, and I don't want no handouts. Like I don't, I'm not looking for anybody to help me. This is easy. I had all that. I built this for free. For free. It was a flatbed trailer like 10 days ago. Now I have a perfectly placed to stay. Bashir says he doesn't plan on going anywhere soon, and even if he wanted to, his truck needs to be fixed. We, as the community, have called the city multiple times over multiple weeks. But residents say nothing has been done. We reached out to both Greeley police and city officials, but have not heard back. We are truly scared as a neighborhood as what will happen next. Bayon Wang, Denver 7.